you want to start selling on Amazon in the UAE. How much is it gonna cost you? All the information in this video, keep on watching. Hi, I'm Crystal. I'm a professional Amazon.ae seller and I'm the founder of Amazon Seller Society Middle East. We provide training and support for people just like you to start selling on Amazon in the UAE successfully. You'll find all the links to our free as well as our paid trainings in the description box below. Leave me any comments, any thoughts, any questions about this video in the comments section below. Of course, there are costs associated with starting your own business on Amazon. However, if you compare them with starting or opening a brick and mortar business or your own e-commerce website, Amazon wins every time. Your main expense is gonna be your inventory or the product that you're gonna be selling on Amazon.ae. You can start with as little as 50 pieces or 50 units all the way up to 3000. There is no minimum, there is no maximum. Amazon doesn't really care. It's your job to decide how much inventory you want to purchase. If you don't have a big budget, you can start with as little as 1,800 dirhams for um, a small order. It could be a, a very small order that uh, requires no big upfront costs and has doesn't have a big risk involved. But on average, we normally suggest that you pay around 7,800 dirhams, which is gonna get you 300 to 500 units. This is an average sample order. It's a good test order to start with. It's the average that normally sellers start with. Remember, the less inventory you start with, the less profit you're gonna make because you're not gonna be able to negotiate a good price with your supplier since you're only buying a small inventory. But you can do that in the beginning, no problem. Second expense is your shipping costs. Normally, we add the shipping cost to the price of the product. So if we say the product costs 20 dirhams, it means that includes shipping from the supplier to the Amazon warehouse. Shipping is something essential because you have to have the products in the Amazon warehouse in the UAE. However, for the purposes of this video, I decided to leave the shipping costs as a separate expense just to explain a little bit more about it. Normally, when you're ordering a small order, a test order or a sample order in the beginning, it's better if you let your actual supplier handle all the shipping for you because they will get a better price than you would on your own. If you want to know a little bit more about how much shipping is gonna cost you, you can go to a website called Fratos.com. If you have the uh, information, the weight, the height, the units, all the information needed from your supplier, you can enter that information and get an actual estimate. Another website that I really like to use is FedEx, UAE version. You also need to have the information and you'll get an idea about how much shipping is gonna cost. If you're ordering a big quantity, definitely try to get your own freight forwarder uh, better than getting um, a, a quotation from your supplier, you're gonna be able to get a better price when you have a big quantity. For small orders, just go with your supplier. Third expense, branding. By branding, I mean logo design and packaging design for your product. Logo design, if you have skills, you can try to do the logo design by yourself. I know a lot of people who are not graphic designers but are very artistic and very creative and have been able to do logos by themselves. Or you can use a website like fiverr.com and get somebody to design a simple, keep it simple, a simple logo for you for as little as 100 dirhams. Packaging, a lot of manufacturers now um, work with Amazon sellers. They can help you with the packaging Yes, it will be very basic. However, you will not have to pay any money, any additional money for packaging design. They can help you with placing the logo 
on the packaging, changing a few things if you want to. They have templates. You can work with your manufacturer. If you want to get an amazing packaging design and something very different than anything out there, you can work with uh, uh, freelancers on a website called 99designs. You can get phenomenal designs for as little as a thousand dirhams. Next, we have product images. This to me is a very, very essential expense. 85% of people purchase products on Amazon based on the images. So you don't want to do all the work. You don't want to do your product research, contacting suppliers, sending the products to the Amazon warehouse and not have good images that are going to hinder your sales on Amazon. However, you can be smart about it. You can take the images from your supplier and give them to a good graphic designer and just make them 10 times better, make them so much better and make them optimized for Amazon. It's going to cost you around 100 to 200 dirhams per image. Remember that Amazon.ae gives you the opportunity to have seven images, so you need seven really good images. If you do have the budget, it's good to work with a professional photographer, maybe not in the beginning, maybe down the line when you know that your product is successful. You can get a professional photographer, they can take amazing photos and just enhance your product quality. Next, we have advertising. Yes, in the beginning, advertising is an essential expense because it's not enough to just get a product on and list it on Amazon. You will not get good sales in the beginning. People will not see your product because of the competition that is currently available on Amazon. Yes, Amazon in the UAE isn't as competitive as, as Amazon.com, but still there are a lot of sellers currently selling on Amazon in the UAE. And if you want to stand out, the easiest way is to just put some ads. You can use social media platforms such as Instagram. I always use Instagram and I get really good results. And you can start your ad campaign for as little as 30 dirhams a day on Instagram. Or you can use Amazon sponsored products. The great thing about Amazon sponsored products is that you're not going to be paying out of your own pocket. You're going to be paying from the Amazon sales. Whenever you make a sale on Amazon, Amazon adds your profits to your Amazon balance, which they pay out to your bank account every two weeks. So you have a margin of two weeks in order to make sales so that Amazon takes the uh, sponsored ad money from your actual account and you don't have to pay it out of your pocket. Last expense is the amount that you have to pay in order to open your Amazon account in the UAE and that is zero. So it's basically free. As of filming this video, Amazon in the UAE have a special promotion where you can open a professional account for zero dirhams a month. Normally a professional account, which is the highest type of account that you can have on Amazon, costs $39.99 on Amazon.com as a monthly membership. On Amazon in the UAE, it costs you absolutely nothing. So what are you waiting for? If you want more information about how you can actually register and open your account on Amazon.ae, you can watch a video that I previously filmed. I'll leave the card up above or you can find the link in the description box below. I'll see you in another video with more information. Bye!